All right. We're back. Give me a second to set a few things up here. Uh, no cam today. I wasn't really sure that I was even going to do this now or tomorrow, but I'm going to be kind of busy tomorrow. So not sure if I'll be able to do it. And I'm in the mood to play the daily, but I'm not in the mood to set up my whole cam uh, setup and all that stuff. Which isn't even that hard. I just got to put the uh, Japanese screen behind me and the lighting. Uh, turn some lights on and uh, make sure that's okay. But I don't know. We're just going to slay some spires today. All right. So I did not stream yesterday. And, uh, well, we'll go back. Here's why. Well, this wasn't why. Here I had a, I'm doing, been playing around doing some watcher runs. I was Sneko at 820. It didn't work today, but, and, uh, Okay, so here's the daily. Well, you see, slain on floor 29. <laughs> this was a tough one. I don't know why this was so hard. But we had, uh, you know, I don't even know what the heck's even going on here. You know what I mean? We had silent. We had defect. It didn't work. I knew when I saw the scores on the leaderboard that it was a tough one. Right? You could tell. No one, like, only like two people had finished it. So I went and looked on my mobile at the thing. And what was it? You start, wait, I'll look again. Oh, I did, right, hold on. So yeah, we started, uh, you see, we got 5X Turbo. So we started with 5 cars Turbo, which isn't that bad. You, I mean, it's good, you get a lot of energy, but once those uh, voids or whatever come back, then you're negative one, you know, energy. And it, it didn't really, it's kind of just spiraled out of control. So yeah, so I saw the, the scores. I went down to my uh, mobile account because I was watching something. I, I, you know, I wasn't in a mood to play on the Xbox like I'm playing now. And I ran to run and I think I died on the first act boss. Like I died really quick. It was really tough yesterday. So then I played it here to see if I could do better. And I did do a little better, but we still failed yesterday. All right, today, it's still early. It just went up like a half hour ago. So there's not that many scores. We got one completed score on the whole leaderboard. So I don't know that this indicates it's a tough run like yesterday because it was a little later yesterday. We get one rare relic. And now every day for the last few days, it's been two combos of uh, characters. Now we got Silent and uh, Watcher, which uh, I think we had that like a couple days ago too. And then we can get more elites or treasures. So we're going to hit the question marks. I don't know. This could be a fun run. Depends on uh, what we get here. Oh, that's a nice relic. All right, well, that's gonna keep us alive at least. It's not uh, the most exciting thing, but we're not gonna die as easily. And we got a three elite path, that's sweet. And we got a couple, a bunch of question marks there in the middle. So we might have a four elite path. So we could die, <laughs> that could not be good. That might not be that good. But it might be okay. All right, let's just, uh, this is an easy fight right now. At least the first turn. But you know, we just have, like, this is a terrible turn. We, we're not getting attacked and we got four blocks. So now we're gonna take some damage. Well, maybe not. I think we'll be all right. All right, we got it. Okay, well, okay, now is when we gotta start thinking hard through violence i mean this is actually pretty good i kind of like backstab here it's like a free you always get 11. i'm gonna take that but this is a really good card for a watcher silent run i think because we're gonna have draw so we're gonna get to that through violence a lot quicker so i might pick that up later but not against backstab i mean backstab is insane on floor one honestly like, look at this. Oh, already 11 damage. And we haven't even spent any energy yet. So we, now we can do 18. Look at that. Down to 18. So yeah, that's pretty good. And we don't have to kill here, but look at that. That incense burner. I mean, come on. So pretty easy fight so far. 
All right, now we got the inner peace. We're definitely taking that. If we can get a wrath and a calm, we're doing watcher stuff. So these cards are both pretty good here. And this is not good here. It doesn't do anything. But it might. And we don't want to get a wrath and not have, a, you know, a calm. I mean, come on. So. All right. It's just kind of fun not doing the cam. I don't know. I'm like a little more relaxed. I like using the cam now that I got it working. Just so you see my expressions and stuff. But I mean, it's also, you got to understand. You're probably watching this on YouTube. I'm streaming on Twitch right now. And, you know, I don't get many viewers on Twitch. I've been getting some decent views on YouTube. You know, at least a few. Um, but, hmm, should I do this or should I just block? We'll just block. Well, just see, this does nothing is the problem. Oh, no, we should do this because all we need is one strike. There we go. All right. So, at any rate. So basically, I started doing these streams just to test my setup, right? Because I wanted to stream um, Persona 4 and uh, maybe some Yakuza games, uh, like a dragon. The new one's coming out in a few days. But I ended up playing this as like a test. And then I'm just like, I play these dailies anyway. I'm like, why not, you know, keep playing the daily? All right. Both of these cards are excellent. They're both kind of two cost. This does, you know, something else. This stays in your deck. You know, two cost card is uh, pretty tough. It's pretty good first turn with that. But I think this is better because then, you know, two cost, then we draw and we can't play what we draw. I mean, this is way better if you got four energy, if you got Sneko, you know, this is a great card on three energy because you can wait till the next turn, play the smite. And then it's especially good on Watcher if when we get Wrath. So you wait till you go into Wrath and then play it. Okay, do we need to remove a card? Or do we want the gold? We're not hitting any shops. Let us remove... Who are we fighting? Okay, Hexagon. Let's re just remove a uh, defend here. Because hopefully we're going to start doing some watcher stuff. Auto strike this might be better. I don't know. Because we are silent still. Okay, here we go. Let's get some match and keep. Now I'm going to save scum. No, I'm not save scumming. I never save scumming this. I, I do a lot of saving and... Uh, oh, Sands of Time. That's a Sneko card. All right. Tranquility might be okay. All right. I might... I don't know, man. Do I even want Sands of Time? I can't even play it. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. Do I want Tranquility? I forget which one it was. Okay. We'll take the Tranquility. Now, do I want Sands of Time? We cannot play it. We don't have four energy, but if I see Sneko at the top, I'm taking Sneko. Or we'll get energy, or, you know, I mean, we can play it because it stays in our hand. So we can play it the next turn. So it's a heavy, heavy good card. Really good against the boss because we can just retain it till it costs nothing. And, uh, good enough, right? All right. All right. So is this a good opening? Uh, I guess. Don't have a lot of block left in the deck. It'd be good to let this uh, simmer, but we're not going to have a good opening in two turns either. Like this is way better unless we redraw this with that one extra, you know, and play. Okay. No, what we'll do is we'll play this and we'll save that. And so at least we'll have that and we want the neutralize to come back on turn, you know, turn two or three of the, uh, whatever this guy is lag. All right, so we can do a little inner piece here, too. And see, we're playing here, and this is a terrible opening, so we really want to draw. I mean, we do have the smite. That's okay. We don't have wrath, so, you know, I mean, anything's not anything's not that great. And look at that. All right, so this is actually really nice. We got that. We got that. And we'll even play this. The only big thing that's not good is that we drew this in this turn instead of next turn. But what are you going to do? And also, I should have been looking up here, and then that would have been better to play earlier. So we kind of wasted that. But, you know, we're, whatever. Mm, why not? Right? I mean, we save the block now or later, you know? 
We can't play this perfect, uh, so that kind of sucks. And this is also, I mean, that was a useless card. I wouldn't have even picked it in a card pick, but we got it, you know, for free or whatever you call it. So it's good enough. All right, should I draw, try to get Survivor? I think I will, because we can play this next turn for free. So let's do this, and at least we got, now we got two blocks, so that's, that's full block, actually, with the weak. All right, this is a very good fight so far, and I think we're, this thing is basically dead. Not quite. Actually, not at all. Uh, we might take some damage this turn, all right. We were not even that close. I'm thinking we're freaking Watcher here, but we're not. But at least we got, look at this. We were close. All right, good enough. Oh, there we go. All right. This is going to be a fun run. Oh, and there we go. Bada bing, bada boom. This is a run. We have a run, folks. We have a freaking run. All right. Make sure I'm on the right path here. Got to go left. Oh, yeah, here we go. All right. Well, we might take a bit of damage in this fight, but we're going to go for it, right? The only problem is we, we won't be able to play this. And it might be th th two more turns till we can play that. But I have to play this. Because look. I mean, we don't even need the Sands of Time, probably. Well, we did. <laughs> we actually did need the Sands of Time. And I, what, we, what we don't need, though, is we're not even taking that much damage. We're in Wrath taking nine damage. I could all I'll, I could play survivor wait I'm gonna play that survivor tranquility here right watch this survivor and I'll get actually get rid of the strike tranquility now we don't take any damage and hopefully we draw the tantrum and we're done and the fight's over all right well that was great see taking no damage on the uh Elites and bosses gives us points at the end, and that's how you get on that leaderboard. That's the easiest possible thing you can go for because, you know, it's just right in front of you all the time. You don't have to, like, manipulate anything. All right, I think Endless Agony sounds pretty good on Watcher, right? Prepared is not going to do it. Follow-up's okay. Endless Agony's free, so follow-up, it's the same thing, right? All right, uh, well, let's take a question mark because that was our, you know, uh, wait, that was just an elite on a question mark. We got our modifier there. I didn't even realize it. Oh my God, we're doing stuff here. We're doing all the stuff. Every, every single thing of stuff we can do. All right. But what we're not doing is, uh, hmm. Well, let's just go into wrath here, right? The problem is this. Uh, we need two turns to do that. But at least next turn, we'll be able to get out of Wrath if we need to. So I'm actually really glad I did pick that up. Super good pickup. And we are we are doing damage here. Look at this. We are doing all the damage. And actually, we might even have a kill here. It, well, we don't. But look how close we are to a kill. And if I played this potion last turn, we would have a kill right now, by the way. Uh, I don't know if you noticed that. So I kind of messed up here a little bit for sure but this is where I should uh, load and then save skull oh no wait this is a kill because it doubles I forgot we have it nice oh my god I almost didn't even realize that I'm like 45 no it doubles we're in wrath I was speaking of dying uh I don't know which is better bowling bash is so good but I mean how often do you get to play die 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 on a freaking watcher I mean we are the silent but you never get this combo, you know, tantrum, die, die, die. That's insane. 26 damage right there. All right. I am super enjoying this run. And there we go. That's pretty good, too. And this is uh, kind of okay. I mean, look at this. We're silent. And we get two extra cards. And then those cards all do vulnerable. We can do so. And we got the backstab. So we have more cards. We got a free card. We are just doing so much on turn one at this point. Look at this. I mean, how many of these guys can we even kill? Maybe just one, but still, that's pretty good, right? 
All right, that's 22. I don't know. Let's, uh, well, let's just do that. Well, right, one's dead. And this one's dead too. All right, there we go. Insane. What do we got here? Shiv? Who are we fighting? Oh, right, Hex. Uh, that works. I, I like, I like having Shivs. Because we're going to definitely take, you know, those ninja relics and all that. Shivs are fun. All right. Well, this is unfortunate. We did not get the tantrum. Or we always want the sands, too, the first turn. So it gets cheaper. But what are you going to do, right? Um, This is still not a bad turn or anything. It's just not going to kill a first turn like we really want to. And so what we're going to do is we're going to save this a smite just play uh let's play this too because then we will be able to play the tantrum into the sands and that is a kill well maybe not <laughs> all right uh 24 though and uh that that's still a kill all right we are super op already hmm another free card Dagger throw is also super nice, which is probably better. I mean, I think card manipulation is probably better than just a free card, right? Yeah, I guess. They're both okay. They're both unnecessary too at this point. But I mean, they're, they're not bad. All right, I kind of want to do this because we always play it, but this might be better. I mean, this is 12 damage. That is just four damage because... We're not always in wrath, and we're usually in wrath for this. So I guess we'll do this. All right, Sands of Time, man. I love that card. Especially since you saw at the beginning, I was playing Sneko Runs recently, and this is the ultimate Sneko card. It's, it's four normally. If you have Sneko, it's a max of three already. Already discounted. Could be zero. Could be one. You retain it. It goes down. So it's always, always discounted. All right, so let's see. What are we going to do here? Uh, we're going to wait. I haven't even played Die, Die, Die yet. That's how good our deck is. I think I'm overpicking also, but uh, okay, we can't play that. I mean, we can. Let's just let's just start then. Because we do want to take advantage of the uh, bag. The bag o marbles. And we will save the smite, I guess, because well, why not? Alright. Well, pretty good. We're not... Unfortunately, I don't think we can play Tantrum here because that doesn't do anything except get us hurt. So we will uh, just play some blocks. That's fine. Full block. Now, full block is key to getting those points at the end, but we're not going to... Uh, unfortunately, we're not going to be able to sustain that. Could upgrade everything, but that's not even close to a kill. This is all we can play. 26, you know, 39. That would be kill if we were in Wrath. But, uh... All we gotta do is this, this, and uh, I guess we'll just do this. So, we take a little here. Or, a big chunk, but we'll be alright. I mean, I'm not... I'm not at all worried about dying. I, maybe I should be. Uh, but, you know... It's only going to be one turn and then they're dead. All right. Well, there we go. There's our block. That'll be nice. Oh, and also we want to lose freaking HP because we got the Hexaghost. The lower your HP, that actually kind of helps that fight a little bit. Because it does less damage on that uh, second turn. The less health that you have. Well, unfortunately, we're not taking any damage on this fight. Well, not unfortunate, but... I mean, I was kind of looking forward to it. All right, I don't know. This is extraneous, but there's no greater feeling than being in Wrath and playing a freaking Blade Dance. I mean, there is, but it's one of the good ones in this game. Really cool combo. Usually, you can only get it with, like, the Prismatic Shard in a normal run. But we are doing it here for no other reason than the fact that we can. All right, let's upgrade this for a little more block. We get a 24 block at our time most in need and we got a power potion too here oh that sucks i would have rather had that next turn or any turn but the first turn um but what are you gonna do 
All right, so uh, we'll play this. I almost want to save backstab for when I. I guess we'll just play the this. Well, you know what? No, 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 no. Let's do a little of this. So then when we do go into wrath, which we're not going to do it next turn though, because that's going to hurt. But if we get it, hopefully the next turn after that, hopefully we get this. I don't know. This is not helping anything. Just doing 12 damage, really. This could give us energy. Well, we didn't get it a good thing, but this is very good because now you're doing less. But I think doing this is a probably a bad idea. It's probably not good. All right, so we don't take that much. We could have even used that upgrade potion, but you know, that was minimal. All right, no block here. I definitely want to pick up a uh, block card or two, but we do a wallop. We just drew it on a total wrong turn. All right, so, uh, well, we'll take 20 here, which isn't that good. Can play Tranquility though. I guess. I mean, I guess I have to, right? Cause why not? It's a lot of damage and we have to wait a long time to get that wrath back we're not getting that wallop on a good turn at all and also this isn't great uh this is not great i might even hold on to the sand let's hold on sand time and block a little bit because we are are not that high enough oh uh, wait maybe we'll get the wallop nope but we're uh okay maybe we're not gonna block uh, I guess we're not blocking, but I am going to play the Tranquility or we're going to be down to 12 HP. All right. Now we're looking good. Uh, you know, oh, look, Tantrum's back. All right. Well, that's pretty nice. So, yeah, that was actually smart. Because now, you know, you're like almost dead. Maybe you are dead. Yeah, you're just dead. All right. Well, pretty good. We did not do a perfect score on that but this will help uh, against the uh being stuck in wrath right oh god well i don't like these options at all this is just no i mean i don't take this on normal runs let alone i'm narrating the freaking run or whatever you know what i mean uh, so i don't know about that but This is pretty okay. It doesn't do anything for that potion. Gives us two copies of that. This is a great card if we add more discard, which we don't. We literally have one discard. And I don't know. I mean, I'm going to pick up other discard, I guess. So I'm, I think I will take that because to me, discard with Watcher, with Scry maybe. I mean, we can have a lot of card manipulation and let's just lean into that. I don't play too many potions with these uh, dailies, honestly. All right. Let's see the elite path here. We got two elite. Oh, we got to look at not the elites. We have to look at the question marks. Now, I don't think elites can spawn on the first few question marks, to be honest. There's something about that. I like that three path, but that's only a one elite path. So we're going to take the center path with the two stores. And the two question marks around that elite right there. And then one there might also be. Uh, and But we're going to take the le left path. Like right here in the middle. I guess. I like that. And then we'll swing up to the bare right. I hit those two shops. Just for that question mark more than anything. Well, we do have a lot of gold. And I'm going to hit all three question marks here. Because they could be a relic or... I don't even care at this point. And there are good uh, Act 2 events as well, which would not be bad at all. All right. And I, I really do want another uh, Wrath Source, but that is honestly asking a lot when you are playing a different character like this. So look at that. We got to kill turn one, though, without even going in Wrath. Mostly from the bag of marbles up here. Look at that. Helping us out. And uh, good news with the... Uh, Incense burner on a good number there, too. All right, and look at this. We're just demolishing you. 
say goodbye. You're out of here. How did I even lose one health? Oh, from the one. <laughs> the one. All right. Uh, oh, piercing whale. Hmm. Well, both of these are really good options for block. Piercing whale is upgraded. This is a great card too, but we technically only have, you know, three energy. So I think I'm going to go for piercing whale here. I wouldn't mind having this in my deck, but I think we'll be okay without it. Oh, wow. Okay. Th this is really nice. I like taking this honestly to get uh, more strength, but we don't need it with this watcher stuff. So we're going to transform a defend and a strike, I guess. Or you know what? I'll just do two strikes because well, we are a little short on block maybe sometimes. Oh, Storm of Steel. That's insane. I love Storm of Steel. And this is great too. Look at that. We do that. We go into a Wrath and suddenly we're blocking for 48 freaking damage there and doing 48 damage. It's got to line up a little, but I mean, and look at this. Double, double, you know, quadruple freaking shivs. Hey, have you ever played that run? Probably not or even better. Okay, superb. Okay, I'm really, I'm really kind of excited about that, honestly. All right, regular enemy here. That's pretty good because I well, didn't feel that great about skipping all those enemies. And do we even have a kill here? I don't think so, but it's possible. Let's see. I hate doing math though. So we got tw 14, 24. Then we got uh, 28, 32 times two 64 and we can still play oh we can't play wallop though that's unfortunate oh we can though if we play this so then we uh yeah i think that's enough right that's more than enough i mean we didn't even need to i was that i forgot the vulnerable okay another, now here's the thing another dagger throw now that'd be nice because we got that kite but the thing is, uh, we have it already. Yeah. I like getting a Highlander bonus at the end where you only get have one copy of each card. You get a hundred points for that leaderboard. And that is honestly, oh, sorry about that. Honestly, the only uh, thing I tried that hard on for the points is that bonus. I mean, you're always want to do the elites perfect and a boss is perfect. Just because it's, you know, it makes you feel good, like you're powerful. So, but the one I specifically will avoid a good card, like Dagger Throw, is kind of better than Prepared here. But, that's going to interfere with my uh, Highlander bonus, right? Anyway, uh, so, you know, draw, this card is not great on Upgraded, because, you know, you draw one, you discard one, you're just drawing what you would have picked anyway if you didn't have Prepared. But... Now it gives us an extra energy, so it's just like a drawing of free energy. So it's actually pretty strong. So, and I honestly don't like it upgraded sometimes because then you're getting rid of a, one of the cards that you actually want to keep. I don't know. All right, let's uh, take some damage here. I've had this on my last few runs. And a random power card. Now that I think can be either class, so. We can either be Watcher card or Silent card. I'm pretty sure that fits in. Yeah, there we go. We got the Watcher card, which isn't a good card because, you know, we got to go five turns for this to matter. Although it's a pretty good card because I didn't even realize it, but this uh, Enchilada Don or whatever the heck you say that is an energy relic, by the way, along with the Mummified Hand. It's given us a power card, and so it's given us a one energy free inner piece right here. Pretty sweet. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right. And we have done a ton of damage here. I think I'm going to play this. Uh, now. Why not? Usually save it for Wrath, but we, we're going to get this kill without even going into Wrath, possibly. Now, this is not good. We might have to play that. Well, maybe we don't. All right, let's see what we got. I guess we don't. Well. 
that does that gives us full exact block right or a little more yeah i don't really want to take what is it 10 damage go down to 43 with a, a bunch of elites coming up yeah you know what free up a slot i mean we're saving almost the whole thing it doesn't matter if we save it in this fight or another fight if you think about it and we have to kill and we got the potion but a slightly better potion all right now here i like to have two of these too but i guess not do i want the third eye i i feel like we're missing block but maybe we do have enough block we got this we got this we got this we got this and you know the normals and also this is block i don't know third eye though scry is good we'll take it it's not bad i don't think i tend to over pick cards though i like having big decks i mean we're playing watcher here pretty much 27 card deck already but we're also playing silence so we can draw more cards than normal we can also play this maybe <laughs> i don't know about that right now but all right let's uh, grab a little energy here and uh well we don't need to play these to block we'll play one now why take two damage right Unless we have to... No, we don't have to kill. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Why am I playing that? What am I doing? All right. Man, I wish we had one of them ninja relics or whatever. Because we would have proc that like three times. Shuriken, kunai, whatever. That would have been sweet. All right. Uh, I might just play this, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, let's go. Inner Peace, Tantrum, Wraith Form. And then we'll be... Well, wait. Did we take the... No. Okay. I mean, I want to play Carve, but... We could just block and take 10. And play Carve, I guess. Because what's our next turn look like? We can't do 90 damage next turn. Oh, but we don't have to. We just have to do it in two turns. All right. Yeah, this is better. Go into Wrath. We get the energy back. Oh, and we got the free block three. All right. Well, that's okay. And then we, you know, too bad we couldn't have kept that card. But what are you going to do? All right. All right. This is great. So now we can scry, make sure we get our attacks next turn. Bottom deck the sands, which isn't good. We got double double. And uh, we got a wallop. I mean, I might even keep the strike at this point. No, we want die, die, die. And dagger throw. So I'm gonna dump the strike. All right. Pretty good. And if we don't, if we don't have the damage, at least we got tranquility to get out of it. But I think we probably do, right? I mean, we definitely do. This is a massacre. Here. We could have killed it with full health almost on that turn. All right. Empty. No bowling. I love a good bowling bash, but I feel like we got the die, die, die. This is good enough, and we're diluting our deck already a little too much. Bowling bash is great. Even in this fight, bowling bash in Wrath is pretty strong. Oh, look at that. Speaking of pretty strong, we got block. Block power. Okay. So we got full block. We could just kill this one also, which is a, probably a good idea. Because uh, we still got full block. And then we'll do the Phantasmal. And uh, you know what? Let's do this too. So if we go into Wrath next turn, we got double, triple, quadruple damage and extra energy. Instead of just doing six here for nothing. Doesn't really help. Well, we don't. Well, we might. And we got this to get out of this situation, too, if we need it. Well, wait, 7 and 8 is 15. I'm just going to play the Piercing Well, because this fight is going to be over soon. Soon enough. And this is good, because it makes them, makes them block less next turn. A little Piercing Well. And a little weakness and uh well it doesn't matter no oh, i should have played it but i mean it doesn't matter because of this all right 
Alright, easy fight. This would be okay. Again, we need like ninja relics, some reason to play a ton of cards, which we don't we don't really have. Or like a wrist blade at the frick freaking uh boss would be nice too, honestly. I mean wrist blade damage with tantrum, I, that's like I, I, the phantasmal combo. It's like ridiculous. Alright, so we upgrade in here. I don't even know what. Oh, Wraith Form. Sure. Alright, so now this will last three turns. Alright, this is the easy run. But it's fun, man. And this is... I like learning about the different card interactions that you never do. That's why I really love these dailies. I mean, I might as well just play this. It's free, and it's not even the one we have in our deck, by the way. So we can get five turns of no damage here. And we got the Wallop. So we're not even taking damage, for sure. I mean, so, so clean. And we even have a kill here on this idiot. Alright, sands of time going down. Everything's falling into place here. Well, we don't have any block, though. So that is actually not good. That's actually not very good. But actually, we do. I think. Maybe. Maybe that'll get down to zero. Because I, I don't care about two damage, but it will make us have uh, less points at the end of the game. Now, I could play Inner Peace, uh, Tranquility Inner Peace here also. You know what? Let's just do that, I guess. I don't know, because I don't know what they're, if this is based on their original health. Uh, they, you know, if they're doing more than eight, then they're still going to do one. So let's do this and hope we just draw a block card. Yeah, we're fine. So uh, we can also get more energy here. For this. So we block, we get more damage next turn, and then that was smart. That was smart. And now we're taking damage, but if we need to, we can do this. But I don't think we even need to. Uh, because, you know, we're doing 104 damage here. <laughs> like, ridiculous. Those guys are a tough fight. Supposedly, I hear. <laughs> I don't know about any more. All right, judgment. No, no, no. Uh, we already have that. Dodge and roll. It sometimes is okay. It's really okay if you don't have a lot of block or if you're scaling your dexterity. That's an, a massively good card. All right, this, this card annoys me because it makes a lot of noise. But look at this. You see what we're doing here, right? You see what's going on here. All right, well, playing the power made Tantrum free. So that's nice. We're playing Sneko before Sneko even cursed us here because we just got to re-roll the cost. And then we got this, and then we got Sands of Time killing the freaking thing. I mean, how good was that? Oh, this is sweet too. Oh my God, this would be good, but we're not doing a ton of shivs. Although the power is free, so I'm gonna, I should have maybe taken that. But we can buy a power here. Well, we're not buying that power. Now we have inner peace. I would love to get another inner peace here, but I still want that Highlander bonus, everyone. Highlander. That's the name of the game. Uh, this is a pretty sweet card, and so is this. I mean, it's Relic and uh, this is super nice. Upgraded. And that's a huge amount of damage. And remember when I said, oh, we, we don't have any reason to be playing all these cards because we're not getting any benefit from a lot of cards. Well, there's your benefit. Panache or panache, whatever. I like singing bowl here. That is also another way to scale our uh, points at the end. All right, I think we're good. I mean, I could remove here, but we do have another shop coming up. So <laughs> the next node. And look at this, we get the bonus. Elite. Well, we're taking damage here. Well, that's fine. Are we, though? Oh, we got the weak potion, though. Maybe not. All right, let's see what we got going here. Shuffle and insight. All right, what did that make? All right, that's pretty good. Well, let's do the old dagger throw and get a little extra energy here, too. Oh, we got weak already. All right, uh, this might be good. We got weak. Well, we don't have full block. So what we can do here is uh, actually use the upgrade potion. Oh, wait. 
why didn't that was that already freaking six block i'm i must not be paying attention here oh well <laughs> i don't know i kind of messed that up that was already upgraded no oh it just oh it doesn't upgrade the block it only upgrades the two shifts i didn't i forgot all about that all right well nothing i can do there then now should i play this i guess why not right all right so we are taking nothing we can do here we could 39 oh if that was a that could have been a kill with that power potion now uh, if that if we're a little closer there right only off by a little all right so no big deal we just don't get the extra 25 points at the end of the game who cares right and we got one more turn here so not a big deal let that sand the time click down and, uh, let's do this all right now you're just completely annihilated all right see we added too many cards which is the other reason i i took the uh singing bowl there look at this who needs more cards you know and now we got more health oh ho, ho, ho. I mean, we're not doing a ton of stance dancing or anything, but it's freaking free. I mean, it only costs 40, which is insanely cheap. And then it gives us a free card uh, besides itself. All right, bottle flame. Should I now do I bottle sands of time? I think so. I mean, I could bottle the, uh, you know, tantrum as well, which probably might be better, but I don't know. Actually, maybe that is better. I mean, we still, you know, as good as his first turn we still want to play calm first in theory right i think i'm gonna buy that crescendo as well so now we will have another wrath all right well this was an insane shop honestly so this uh solves that problem now that will always cost three on turn two which is in insane we could get the ore calcum but i think we're okay on block let's just take this uh, crescendo that's not bad, but I think unnecessary. And then I think we're good without a potion. All right. And we get the freaking free uh, rest there. So we're f full health. We're going to upgrade. Uh... Well, maybe not. Maybe that. I don't know. Hmm. I guess backstab, we're always playing it, right? It's always, it's weird to have like an innate card that you don't upgrade, right? Any, any of those would have been okay. I don't, I don't think it matters at this point. All right, got full block with Walla. And this is pretty nice. Look at this. We're going to get some upgraded shivs right now. And I could even go into Wrath here, which I might as well. Although it's nice to save this, but we got full block. Or do we? No, then I can't. Oh, yeah, that's free. Okay. Oh, we're doing good. This is so good. Full block. That's worth a ton. Oh, we had more than full block because the uh, the bag of marbles. These do 12 now. 18. Man, I wish I had some vulnerable uh, for other than turn one. I could play this. Okay, now next turn, we, you know, we don't want to get stuck in Wrath for too long here. Although this turn's fine, so we're good. That's not worth it. This is definitely worth it. This is pretty good. And, uh, I kind of want to go into Calm, I guess, but I kind of also want to see what else we get here. Oh, okay. Well, we're not going into calm. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I, I, you know, when you can do quadruple damage next turn with the sands of time at two, we might even have a kill at this point. I guess not, but he's not even doing damage. And 12 times three is probably more than that's going to give me. All right, you're almost dead. But not dead, so that's 
not good. <laughs> All right, but we got our uh, out out here kind of. I could play the power potion. This is not enough to kill. This is good though. Right, we're still not there, so we gotta play th these three for sure. And that, oh, wait, we can also play that. So that's good. And we're also gonna take some damage here, uh, unfortunately, so. Just a little though, but kinda sucks. We're so close to getting a perfect fight there. Panache has not done anything, but that's okay. Too bad we didn't have this thing lined up last turn. All right, Ragnarok. That's pretty good. I think it's a little unnecessary, though. We don't really have a uh, enough energy depending on our relic. We got our heavy attack already. I don't. I don't think we need another one. Even our shivs are doing a ton of damage. Burst. Blade dance is pretty cool, though. Burst, piercing well. Burst, uh, I don't know what else. Third eye's not, not even bad. I don't know. I kind of like the burst. I don't think it's that great. But it could be fun. Oh, burst, uh, the, this too. Phantasmal. Two turns. Quadruple damage. I'll take it. Okay. Well. Huh. I guess we're taking this. <laughs> Coffee dripper, we're staying awake. No resting. But we got a lot more, a little more energy. And uh, that means we start each turn with five energy. Kind of. Or more. Depending on what that uh, free, that power makes free. And we, I, I mean, we're going up the middle, right? So. Three elites. I'll take the question mark. All right, the free master of reality, a free panache. We're doing some stuff here. We are doing the stuff, all the stuff. Look at this, everything's freaking free. Oh, do you want another free card? Yeah, sure. Let's take another free card. We don't have enough block, but it doesn't matter except on the elites, honestly. I mean, you know, we can't heal, but we don't need to. We don't even take any. All right. Empty body? I don't know. I don't think we need it. We'll just take the HP. Oh, let's take all our gold. Uh, I'll pass. Oh, do we even have a shop? We don't have a shop, but weakness? I don't know. We're killing them before they attack for the most part. Sort of. Oh, Santa time's free. All right, well, you're dead. One of you guys is dead. I guess we'll play the strike. Oh, wait, they're already dead. What did I just do? I hit the wrong one? Oh, I messed up my uh, click and I took a little damage there. Oh, well. That's not good. Because now this is going to hurt us. Mm. Oh, just a little. All right, I totally messed that up. Well, we need that. Huh. I just misclicked. Because I guess I counted three and the one was dead already. I don't know. I guess we can just play this. This is not going to cycle back even. Although... I don't know. It's just two. The, th the three from the thorns is more what I was annoyed at. Alright. Well, good enough. We lost five that we definitely did not need to, but I think we'll be okay. There we go. Oh, this, uh, this is an easy fight. Usually. I shouldn't talk trash, but... Usually an easy fight, uh, if you can get into Wrath. Alright, we're gonna keep this. I think it goes back up to three now. But, you know, you just have to do enough damage to lower that number, uh, it, against this enemy. 
Oh, look at this. But this is the first time we even use this card. All right, so now we're good. Mental. All right, zero. We can save that. We can do this. Make sure. Uh, you know what? We just play this and the game's over, honestly. Because uh, three more turns. We don't even have to worry at this point. Oh, once we play this thing. Well, we will take one, but who cares? I mean, we already had it at one, you know? It's pretty funny. Actually, uh... I guess it doesn't matter. Oh, there we go. Let's do this. Taking one is fine. And then, you know... We don't even need to worry too much. We can just block. And then one more turn and we still got intangible. We actually had an extra turn of intangible from the uh, burner up there. So all we need to do is block. I'm playing too many cards for no reason. All right, easy fight. And uh, just lucky, I kind of like just lucky, honestly. I kind of like it. Helps with panache. I don't know. I just have a soft spot for that card. It's not even that good. It's only good if you have dexterity scaling or, you know, a other type of scaling. Strength scaling. That's when it's really strong. I mean, I might as well just play this at this point, right? Oh, I could have bursted that. Maybe I'll just play the block. I don't know. Just to avoid one, since we can't heal at all. Or we might storm a steel. Or we might just kill this, right? All right, good enough. Did a little panache uh, damage, I think. to get in wrath i mean it kind of sucks that we haven't had another uh, wrath source but what are you gonna do i mean it's not that that was that hard of a fight i gotta stop taking cards we don't need any of these cards do i need colorless i don't think it matters okay two more elites three more elites and uh only one question mark in there maybe four more elites this is a long run though. We're already, uh, you know, almost over 45 minutes into this run here. Do I want this card? Uh, not particularly, but why not? It gives us something for free. And we got a big hand this time maybe. Oh, look at this. And we got the Wraith form too. Let's play that first. Wallop. Oh my god, what a turn. We can play almost everything here. Oh, you're just dead. Like, just dead turn one. <laughs> Speaking of dead turn one. Uh. That could be okay. I don't think I'm going to take it, but that's another free uh, card. But it's one less other card that we're drawing. We're not switching stances that often. We mostly just go into Wrath. I don't... Have I ever even gone out of Wrath? Like, on two fights, maybe. This is not a stance dance deck. This is just a let's kill everything as quickly as we can deck. All right, Burst isn't doing anything here. And we got the Akabeko. We don't need the block. So, let's gonna display that. Play a little of that, a little bit of that, a little bit of that, and some of that, and uh, you're down uh, not a ton. Could have been better, but not bad. Burst is ruined, but 
It's okay, we're intangible. So we can just do all the damage. Uh, what are we gonna do here? I guess this. Now do I play this? Or no, we'll just play these. Save that. We're weakened, so we're not doing a ton of damage there, by the way. Alright, well, might as well play this and just finish this fight out later. And now we're safe for three more turns. Two more turns now. Uh, we should be okay. I don't think we need to go into calm at all. We don't want to play this <laughs> until we play this. But we might as well get a little extra here. Bada bing, and now we're we're still safe for this turn, and you're just gonna die. Dead. Alright. We're good on this. We just get more health. Alright, a very comfortable run so far, but anything can happen in the Spire. We're just so big on this all this intangible and everything here. Oh man, this might just be dead this turn too. We can burst the freaking blade dance too. Oh, let's backstab. Oh, we didn't even need the even one blade dance. Who are we fighting? Time Eater. Of course, it had to be freaking Time Eater. You have to ruin my freaking fun. Oh my god. Well, we might have a turn one kill. Who knows? <laughs> right? That would be nice. Now we can toke here. Remove a card, but we're gonna upgrade something. I don't know what. What's a good upgrade? Uh, everything's okay. I mean, die, die, die is okay. Let's do blade dance. No, we don't want blade dance. What am I talking about? We're doing, we're doing freaking uh, time eater. An extra shiv is just gonna go back into our freaking pile. <laughs> or if we even play blade dance, uh, we're only playing that when it's time to kill. <laughs> oh, we're playing blade dance against this thing. This is a good one to get a turn one kill on, but it doesn't look like I have it. Not even close. Although, we could do some of this shenanigans. I mean, we might as well. A little draw. Another free card, maybe. Alright, not terrible. This is useless, because this thing is intangible next turn. We don't need to block. We could have scried. That would have probably been a better play than playing the strike. Oh no, the strikes were free. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. We'll just block. Now, we can't play this. <laughs> we can play these. Just for another one. Whatever. All right. Well, this looks like a kill to me. I'm not doing the math. But I feel like uh, this thing is definitely dying. We don't even need to burst. Oh, the panache killed it. Okay, that's uh, completely extraneous. That could be insane, but... We're just gonna get more health. I don't think I've taken a card this whole act. Maybe, oh, like one card, right? What card was that? Oh yeah, just luck. Just lucky's the only card I took. All right, look at this, we got the classic. We'll go infinite. No. <laughs> We're not going infinite. But, uh... Oh, let's do this. Get some more energy and some more cards. I'm just gonna... I could've... I should've played this first. Was not thinking. Actually, let's... Oh, I don't want to use the sand. I, didn't, I just realized Storm of Steel is not good until we play the uh, sands. It just, just took me this long to realize that, but, uh, because I would play that right now. I could have gone into Wrath, too. Uh, yeah, let's just, honestly, I'm just gonna burst that, and just to set up next turn. Oh, 
that's good. All right, we don't need to block. Oh, it does it twice. It doesn't do six cards. Okay, well, that was a little underwhelming there. And we don't need to block. But, whatever. It's not that big of a deal. Uh, this has to be the kill, right? No, maybe not. Well, we'll just play this. We'll wait. Let me double that. Oh. Whatever. We only lost one HP this whole time. Empty mind, uh... That does sound pretty good. Although, I don't know. Time Eater? Oh, can we even play those cards? Huh. Let's take it. I don't want to get... I don't know. It's, it's such a good card, right? But we can upgrade all cards. I might just take that. Why fight another boss? We can just upgrade everything here. We can no longer heal. Well, we can't heal anyway. And we have no healing cards. Ow, that was freaking loud. I usually don't take that, but you know, you don't want to take it on Ironclad because you always heal that little, you know, with the relic. You don't want to take it if you have post healing potions even, but in this situation, why not? Looks good to me. I don't think we need to defend. And we will, uh, let's draw more because we don't have much here. And I don't want to play the Storm of Steel. Or that. Should have played a strike earlier. Alright, pretty good hand. Uh, pretty good uh, opener there. play this until I'm in wrath although I might have to all right wait oh we don't oh, I gotta play this to, for the one block just for the you know little bonus at the end and for pride at this point so we don't want to <laughs> now we have a little too much energy but a little useless but what are you gonna do all right uh then we draw two. Let's play this first. I don't know. I guess we don't need burst. Or kind of tranquility. Don't need burst. And so then we got to get rid of one of these two, I guess. I don't know. Whatever. might get rid of both of them yeah not great but we're, we're redrawing soon we have our block we'll save this until we are in wrath okay we're good <laughs> we're pretty freaking good all right let's just uh, save our energy here I could play this I guess make one of these free that's a hundred damage. With the slow debuff, that is now 166 damage. Double damage, Phantasmal Killer. Double, double, Wrath. 60% more than that. <laughs> 166. Not bad, I wish I had one more energy here. But I think we're gonna be okay. <laughs> I mean, I think we're th this thing is dead. All right, pretty fun fight. Well, that's useless. That is not. That is a pretty cool card. 
we will take that card and we will upgrade that card because it's literally the only card that needs to get upgraded <laughs> and it's pretty damn good upgraded card all right well we're over the hour mark here this was a long one a lot of decision making okay intangible these are not great because it's i mean they are good if we're at 11 or whatever but you know what i mean this i hate this freaking fight i hate when i'm having a fun run like this and then it's just uh oh now we gotta pay attention to everything we're freaking doing i guess i'll play this all right back step for sure this for sure this for sure I might as well. Now, seven is okay, I guess. I don't know. I'm just gonna, uh, I'm gonna wait. Because it, we can play one of those potions if we need to. Oh, the draw down is miserable. All right, let's, uh, Well, we have 15 blocks, so I think that's actually good, right? Like, that's fine? And then what we do here is we play this uh, power potion. Oh, we have more block, too. After image sounds good, right? Or shivs. Uh, let's do after image. And then we do this. That was free, but we can't play it. And we full block. And, uh, you know, it was a decent... Not, you know, not amazing, but good enough, right? All right, so here we can't even... Well, we can block, because look at this. One, two, three. We're full blocked. Oh, I should have played that, but whatever. We don't need to. Now we want to kill quick. If we can, which we can't, <laughs> but whatever. Oh, we don't even need to play this. All right. Maybe next time. All right. Well, this, this took too long. I don't like what just happened. It took too long. And uh, now we're going to get screwed. Maybe. Well, we have it under the uh, limit there, right? Or not, not yet, but... And I think I'm gonna play these... Uh, I don't know. I don't want to just have a two-turn next turn, but the thing is, it's gonna be buffing, or whatever it does. So, it's actually good. I think that's actually good. So, we'll just do two-turn next turn. Two cards. I think that's good because we if we do damage it's just gonna get you know the damage off unless we did 192 damage which we're not gonna do so that you know we have to wait till next turn here so we can just do uh well it doesn't matter what we can do is this tantrum to put it back in our pile and a strike i mean it doesn't matter now, now it's going to get tricky for one turn if we can't kill. Well, not really, because the incense burner lined up. Or we had one more. I don't even know. So we're good. We have all the turns we need. We got... Well, we don't need third eye. I don't know. Maybe we did. At least we have this. All right, we're still ways off from getting this fight done. Oh, there we go. That'll help too. What was this? Oh, I can't heal. Well, what does that mean? Oh, I, cause I had the, uh, whatever, this. Okay. All right, well, maybe we can do 104 damage here, but maybe not. That ain't enough. That uh, could help. <laughs> All right, this is not great. Uh, 
kind of sucks, actually. This was very late coming into our day. Oh, we played it. That's why. All right. Well, we got some stuff going on here. I mean, we're good, right? We're actually good. And just this for good measure. All right. No damage. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Zero block, though. All right, this is not great. <laughs> uh, damn. Pretty bad. I don't know how this happened. We're not quick enough against the time meter. All because the, you know, the buff turn. Uh, I don't know. I guess we're just going to do some damage here. Take a little. We're not dying or anything. Not the end of the world, but we don't get that bonus at the end. And this turn sucks too. But we can draw a little. Do a little this, do a little that, do a little this, do a little that. And then we're good next turn, so. I think. Alright, well we did it. It wasn't how I wanted it to go. Uh, we were so close to getting a perfect fight there. We're not going to have a great score, honestly. 1164. Okay, well, that's not bad. We did do a lot of elites. So that, that's where the score comes from. We did get Highlander bonus, 100. Librarian, we had a lot of cards, which is weird. Only 35, all right. Champion, eight elites, perfect. Three non-perfect and no perfect bosses, which is pretty bad. But overkill is another 25. All right. I mean, that's average. I don't think we're on a leaderboard today. But who knows? Maybe it was harder. To, maybe it's hard for everyone. Let's see. Now, yesterday, we didn't finish. So that's pretty bad. But two days ago, not that great. Oh, but three days ago, that's that's the best I ever did. <laughs> top five. All right. But today, oh, well, we're top four. But we're going to slip for sure. And look at that, we're tied with, that person was number one when we started, and then the other two played while we were playing, so. Not bad. I mean, I guess that's okay. We tied for fourth, we'll probably slip off to first page, I'm guessing. All you have to do is beat one boss, perfect, and you'll beat our score, so. I don't know. I'm pretty happy with that, though. We're top five for now. It's still very early, only been out for two hours, not even, so. You know, I think I'll be maybe in the top 50. That's my prediction, but I might do tomorrow's. Who knows? Well, I might do it the day after. So this one I did early because I'm a little busy during the day tomorrow, but maybe at night or I might do that one on Thursday. Anyway, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to like or, you know, follow or sub or, you know, whatever it's called. Follow over on Twitch. Subscribe over here on YouTube, whatever or not. I don't care. You know, just watching. If you watch to the end, that's amazing to me. Thanks for watching. All right, we'll see you next time.